Let us now take the sixth model from time and distance where we shall discuss another typical question from this topic where we have to find out the stoppage time of a vehicle. Let us look at the concept first. Excluding the stoppages, the speed of a vehicle is SE and including the stoppages, the speed is SI. Then the stoppage time is given as SE minus SI by SP. So here as you can see, we can take the stoppage time directly as the speed excluding the stoppages minus speed including the stoppages divided by speed excluding the stoppages. So with the help of this simple formula, we can find out the stoppage time directly without writing any further steps. Let us look at an example here. Excluding the stoppages, the speed of a bus is 64 kilometers per hour and including the stoppages, its speed is 48 kilometers per hour. So for how many minutes does the bus stop per hour? So here as you can see, we need to find out the number of minutes for which the bus stops per hour. Now, as given in the question, excluding the stoppages, the speed is 64 kilometers per hour. That means when the bus runs non-stop without stopping at any places, the speed is 64 kilometers per hour. Remember, in general, when we say speed here, it is average speed of the bus. So average speed of the bus is 64 kilometers per hour without stopping at any place. And including the stoppages, its speed is 48 kilometers per hour. So when the bus stops at different places per hour, it can cover only 48 kilometers. So we can say that its speed is 48 kilometers per hour on an average. So we need to now find out for how many minutes does the bus stop per hour. Now as given in the formula here, stoppage time can be taken as the speed excluding stoppages minus speed including stoppages divided by speed excluding stoppages. So speed excluding stoppages is 64 minus speed including stoppages is 48 divided by speed excluding stoppages is 64 again. So this comes out to be 64 minus 48, 16 by 64, which is 1 by 4. So here very clearly the stoppage time is 1 by 4. Now because the speed is given in kilometers per hour, this is 1 fourth of an hour or 1 by 4 hours. So we can say that the stoppage time is 1 by 4 hours. But as the question says, for how many minutes does the bus stop per hour? Let us now convert this hours into minutes. We have learned in the beginning of this session that to convert hours into minutes, we need to multiply the magnitude with 60. Why? Because each hour has got 60 minutes. So, one fourth of an hour can be taken as 1 by 4 into 60 minutes. And 4 here goes 15 times. So, we can say that the bus stops for 15 minutes every hour. So, friends, this is how we can solve this simple question with the help of the direct shortcut formula here. So, remember, stoppage time is always speed excluding stoppages minus speed including stoppages by speed excluding stoppages.